Hello, welcome to a new day, a new vlog, and a new day of Vlogmas. Today I'm coming at you right from where I left you last night. I have been doing a bunch of client work, posting stuff on social media, doing some research for some website stuff. It's been a very busy morning. Right now it's 12.57 p.m. and I have to get to town because I need to go do some content creation for a client. I need to meet up with George to drop off his SD card reader and then I need to pick up Kyle from work. I may need to stop off at the bank. So we have a full day of stuff to do. So I'm gonna take you along with me today and we're gonna go have a productive day. I actually tried to keep Fridays as chill as possible, but that just did not happen this week at all. Nothing went to plan. I was actually supposed to be leaving on Wednesday to go to St. Thomas, but we decided to push the trip back. So we're probably going to be leaving on Monday instead. So at least you guys have that to look forward to in the vlogs um, coming up. But um, I just have, like I said, a bunch of client work to do today. Um, some stuff just kind of popped up. So I'm going to get all of that done and then I'll be able to everything else I should be able to get done remotely so um, I don't have to actually be on island to do it so that's the plan not gonna lie I'm feeling kind of stressed today because I was kind of on a time crunch this morning now that I finished those things I'm fine I have a video that's um, uploaded right now it's my coconut festival video so if you haven't seen that video make sure you go watch it um, it's uploading Adriel is going to um, change the status from private to public for me so it's actually posted and I finished the thumbnail before I got home I didn't get a chance to upload it but I do have YouTube studio on my phone so I'll be able to um, put the thumbnail on the video before it actually goes live so very excited about all that I'm very proud of myself for still keeping up with vlogmas through all of this uh, work stuff that I have going on like I said in yesterday's vlog things are or have been kind of crazy and I've been struggling I've been struggling trying to figure out like my actual schedule and usually I feel like I'm a pretty like organized person and I am organized it's just that there's a lot to do so I'm working on it day by day taking it day by day and yeah this camera is about to die so I have to change out the battery but I will talk to you guys when I get to town okay I'm in town it's freaking hot and I had to park kind of far but it's okay, so I'm gonna be in the AC pretty soon. I made it back to my car. It is such a hot day outside. Walking back here was a trek, but um, now that I'm done with this, I'm feeling a lot better. I just have to go home and actually edit the photos. I'm gonna do some graphics on basically all the photos and do like a countdown to Christmas type situation. So yeah, I gotta, I gotta go work on those pretty quickly because I want to have that done by this weekend so that all of their posts for the rest of the month are scheduled and ready and good to go. I'm gonna go head to the bank now. I have to go deposit a check and then I'm sure I have to go pick up Kyle by that time. So yeah, let's go. So I feel like all I've been doing is complaining about the heat in this video so I decided to do something about it. Um, I decided to go get a smoothie. There are a couple places where I really love getting smoothies from. Number one, if I want like a sweeter, you know, I really want to treat myself to a smoothie today type smoothie, I'll go to Grounded Cafe. So they have different locations. They have one in the Via building. There's one at the food court in Sony Isles, and then there's another one across from Pujan Gold in Christian said town. Now, right now, I'm at Seaside because my second um, option for smoothies um, when I want one that's more on the healthier side a nice green smoothie that still tastes really good this is where I come so I'm gonna go inside I'm gonna see if they have my favorite smoothie and just cool off because I need it I am really, really, really satisfied with this. So good. It's so refreshing. <laughs> I'm driving. <laughs> I'm on the bypass right now. I'm heading to the highway. I gotta go pick Kyle up. I actually saw my friend Majid in Seaside. It's always good bumping into old friends. I literally only ever see him when I'm in there. <laughs> 
this old lady actually asked for a ride and I have a strict I'm not giving anybody rides rule but I broke it and the reason why I made this rule is because a few years ago like when I had just moved back home this old lady who I guess was maybe living in my grandma asked for a ride like she was just walking on the road it was like nighttime so I was like why is this old lady walking on the road and she like waved me down because she needed a ride so I was like all right cool I'm gonna give this lady a ride then she halfway through the ride the lady was like um asking me for money and I was like I don't have any cash I don't have any money to give to you and it was like she didn't have an actual place that she wanted to get dropped off at and then after thinking through the situation I was like I wonder if she ran away from home <laughs> like I didn't know what was going on and so I decided that that was a bad idea and that I should never give anybody rides ever again and that was also my first time giving somebody a ride and now here I am in Seaside today and this other old lady asked for a ride and she introduced herself and there was a lot more that happened that I don't think I can get into right now but basically I was low-key kind of scared and I was like all right I'll give you a ride across the road so I gave her a ride across the road to her house and everything was fine I survived but um, as much as I can in the future I'm going to avoid giving anyone rides because it always just makes me so nervous because I just don't know what's happening and I don't want to be caught slipping you know okay well that's the end of that story time time to go get Kyle I'm here for Kyle. The smoothie is almost done. I'm feeling kind of disappointed in myself because honestly, I just need to speak about my business more and start pitching to people to get more clients. And I get nervous every time the opportunity comes up. So I have to work on that. But yes, Kyle is here, time to go home. I need a nap. Hey vlog. <laughs> How's it going vlog? Hey vlog. Welcome back to another Kyle Cam. I can't hear you. Welcome back to another Kyle Cam. She just picked me up from work. And we're going to the bank. Um, my arm hurts. Alright guys, we'll see you in the next one. Bye. That's <laughs> hey guys, I have no idea how I forgot that I had this party to go to today. But Adriel and I are about to leave the house to go to Denise's birthday party, which is going to be on a boat. Probably on island time again. So, I'm ready. I just did my makeup really quick. Put on this romper um has a really cool bow in the back my bathing suit is on i don't think i'm swimming but it's a boat party so i put on a bathing suit anyway um that was a part of the attire the attire that was requested for the party is bathing suit beach formal not formal this is what i'm wearing <laughs> The squad is out. We're waiting for our boat. Holden is the host. <laughs> <laughs>